Okay, so we're back with another Da Vinci Resolve video because those vids just seem to bang. Um, so we're back with a color correction video because I have been asked by one of my subscribers. He's, he's been asking many times and I've just never came across to doing it. So today I'll be showing you the color correction for your Fortnite videos to make them look much better. So the first thing you're gonna to wanna to do is go into the description of the video and you should pop up into this link and um, what you got to do is press download and then just wait until it downloads so as you can see the um, download is finished so you can just drag it down to desktop down here close that open it up click on here then click on here press yes it's just going to start to download into your computer next uh, then you're gonna have to press on key te uh, key dot text over here. Then you should get sync like this. Then you open it back up. Then highlights. I think it's the first one. Control C, Control V, submit. There you go. So there we go. Then you press next. Then you press I accept the agreement. Next. Then you choose DaVinci Resolve right there next install and you just wait for it to install then press finish just close that down close that down close all this down and then what you're going to do is just go into davinci resolve also a quick thing if the um plugin doesn't work just restart your pc because i remember with the rsmb people having problems and when they restart their pc it just seemed to work so if you've got any problems just restart your computer and it should work so then just grab your uh drag your clip in so i'll just drag any clip doesn't really matter for this for the sake of this video i'm just gonna grab any clip change drag it down there we go then the first thing you're gonna want to do is press effect the effects library over here toolbox effects adjustment clip like this the adjustment clip is whatever you put on it will affect the video down below but if you say if you've got loads of clips you just spread it out wider so you don't have to do an individual clip every clip you put on so this just saves so much time just if you ever do rsmb put it on here i forgot to do that in the last video but just put your rsmb on here put your everything on there so like the cc effect we're just about to do now and yeah then when you have done that just assert, just press open effects and if you scroll down you should find switch up film yeah, it's right there drag that into adjustment clip so right now it looks quite dark and grim so just press open effects go down to strength put this on 50 then for the print stock you just put uh, this one i don't know how to pronounce that but you know um then the next one is Yeah, the 500d one put your color temperature at 50 then put the my footage is and then vid, um, as video then for exposure just put 0.60 then for grain put zero so then we're going to add something else to it as well okay so when you have put the second film on just double click on here and then double click on this one then there should be another film and what we want to do is put and for negative stock do that one they all look they all look different so it's sort of up to preference to be honest because they all look different so you can go through each one and see which one you'd prefer but for the sake of the video we click on, on the p4300 one and then for print stock you're going to want to use this one so as you can see that looks much better from what it looked originally where it's very blue and then it dis adding both of these gives it like a warm vibe so if you add like a quite a slow song to this that would look amazing and pretty good and pretty clean to be honest 
so if you use this and use all the other tutorials that i've posted on my youtube channel you'll be making some really good montages on fortnite davinci resolve so i hope you guys enjoyed today's video if you did drop a like if you're new around here subscribe turn post notifications on if you haven't already and yeah peace